Hey guys, so I'm sorry for posting late videos. It's been kind of hard in school lately, so well now I have time to make a video and here it is. So today I'll be telling you guys about um Samsung Galaxy Y games and how they work. Well at first I'm sorry I haven't been posting videos, yeah, again I'm sorry. And yeah, let's go on with the game. So here's one of my favorite games, it's a tower defense game, so you probably know it, it's Plants vs Zombies. Yeah, and I'm gonna, cause I'm doing this video because a viewer actually suggested that I do games, okay, so, yeah, probably I'm gonna review ROMs too and some games in the future, I'm not sure, so, let's get on with it. So, first thing you need to do is, you have to be rooted well you don't necessarily have to but the game will be ugly if it's not rooted that's because here look wait it's loading it's a really slow phone since it's only an 832 megahertz phone Okay. See, look at that. That's beautiful. That's how it is. That's how the game really is. But sometimes when you're not rooted, you're going to experience it having white blank white on the background. So First you need to download Chainfire 3D from the market and it's it's just that and you have to download its drivers. Um you can just search on Google its drivers. There's an NVIDIA driver, there's a Power RV wait, Power VR driver and there's a Qualcomm driver. Here it is. Okay, wait. Okay. Yeah, well, that's actually it. I'm not using the pro version because I don't really need to. So, yeah. And you need to download its plugins. So, you do that by searching on Google. You just search um Chainfire 3D plugins. That's it. And we are going to download Plants vs Zombies, okay? Wait. Okay, there it is. And it's probably some of the first ones. And I suggest you download it from 4Shared or some trustable site. Probably the XDA developer site. And yeah. So for the app itself, Plants vs Zombies, um, it's quite big. I suggest you download the. What do you call this? Um the 75 megabytes version since you don't have to download from the internet anymore that's basically it that's, that's the app and yeah that's the game then you install it you change you go to change fire 3d and you install here see it says here install plugin shaders I've still I installed all the plugins and you just go to here, load the plugin, then Qualcomm. Qualcomm is the probably Qualcomm. Yeah, that's, that's the one they want to load. And yeah, that's, that's basically it. And you get to play it. Now you'll you'll know you played it. You know you set it up successfully if when you're playing the the background isn't white. You actually see the full game running. So that's how you play Plants vs Zombies. Hope you like this video. Hit the like button up there or down there, I don't know. And the subscribe button somewhere around the video. Thank you guys. Bye. Subscribe.